what was lost in a fire nearly two years ago, now begins its rise from the ashes. Beale Air Force Base celebrated the groundbreaking for two new military construction projects on Friday, April 3rd. One of the new facilities is a replacement for a Civil Engineer Squadron building that burned down on January 21st of 2013. The fire destroyed furnishings, computers, and shop equipment, displacing nearly 200 squadron personnel to geographically separate facilities or temporary trailers on the CE compound. The new building will not only grant the space required for CE personnel, but it will also help restore the squadron's capability to support the wing's mission. It's going to be a LEED certified facility. LEED stands for Leadership in Environmental and Energy Design. Um, that focuses on minimizing the impact of facilities on the environment and also creating uh, positive work environments for the people that will inspire them. The other facility recognized in the groundbreaking was the expansion of the distributed common ground system for the 548th Intelligence Surveillance and Reconnaissance Group. After a study in 2010 showed a lack of space to accommodate new mission growth, a plan was put in motion to build another facility to relieve the deficit of space. The new facility will co-locate Air Force DCGS operators, maintainers, support personnel, and mission systems that help support 25 sites from around the world each day. Uh, I just want to say on behalf of the congressman, uh, it is an honor to be out here, to be a part of this recognition for Team Beale. These MILCOM projects that are being executed here at Beale, I mean, what they represent is, is a commitment to Beale Air Force Base. Uh, for today's mission, in the mission long into the future. The CE Squadron building is estimated to be done by August of 2016 and the DCGS building by November of 2016. After construction, the two new facilities will help increase morale, communication, and efficiency for the airmen of Beale Air Force Base. Reporting from Beale Air Force Base, California, I'm Airman First Class, Benjamin Buganig.